guys, it's Sabrina. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, hi, I'm Sabrina. Um, before you get started, make sure to subscribe, give this video a thumbs up. And yeah, so for today I did this like fairy tale princess pink purple look. Um, but it was inspired by Shelby. I don't know how to say her last name and I don't want to mess it up. So I will just leave her name down below. But yeah, if you want to know how to do this look, just keep watching. Okay, so first I'm going to be taking the Power of Makeup palette by Nikki Tutorials and Too Faced and I'm going to be taking Wham Bam which is this purple right here and patting it along my crease. Okay, and then once I have that purple packed in, I'm going to be taking a blending brush and just blending, blending the outer corners out. Okay, and then taking the Take Me To Brazil palette, I'm going to be taking this pink right here and putting it on the inner corner of my crease, just above that purple. And then taking a blending brush, I'm just going to be blending that pink. Okay, so next I'm going to be taking the Take Me To Brazil palette again and taking this red right here and putting it in the center of my crease. Okay, and then next, taking this one from the Taking Crystal Pot, I'm going to put it on the outer corner of my crease. Okay, and then once I have all those colors on, I'm going to be taking some concealer and just cutting my crease. Okay, so next I'm going to be taking those three colors that we put in the crease, the pink, the red, and the orange, and just kind of like putting them right on top of the cut crease, but like not all the way down. You'll just, you'll see.
Okay, and then I just carved out my crease again, and now I'm going to be taking the Power Makeup Palette again. I'm taking Ivy and setting my lid, and also I'm going to be taking Wham Bam and just blending that at the outer corner. Okay, and then I'm going to be taking the NYX Glitter Glue and the Too Faced Glitterly Glitter, and I'm going to be very, very lightly dusting that on the white part of the cream. Okay, so that's it for the eyes for now, and then I'm going to move on to the face. So first I'm going to be taking the NYX Angel Veil Skin Perfecting Primer and just putting that on my T-zone. Okay, and then for foundation, I'm going to be mixing the Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Foundation with the Too Faced Born This Way Foundation. Okay, and then for concealer, I'm going to be going in with the Too Faced Born This Way Multi-Use Sculpting Concealer. Okay, so for powder, I'm going to be taking the Laura Mercier Loose Powder in Translucent and using a damp beauty blender to pack that on under my lid. My lid, my eyes. While that's baking, I'm going to be doing my under my under eye, and I'm going to be taking that purple that we used in the crease, and then also taking that hot pink and blending it out. Okay, I look crazy, but I'm going to be taking my damp beauty blender and 
pressing that powder in and then going in with a blending brush and blending that bottom waterline. Okay, so next for bronzer, I'm going to be taking the Too Faced Chocolate Soleil Bronzer and the Butter Bronzer by Physician Formula. Okay, so I just put some bacon under my bronzer and on my nose. And for blush, I'm going to be going back in with that Power of Makeup palette. I'm going to be taking this pink blush called Justify My Love. Okay, so I wiped away that bake and I'm going to be doing highlight and for highlight I'm going to be taking the ABH Glow Kit in Sun Dipped and I'm going to be taking Moonstone which is this like champagne pink color but I'm also going to be mixing it with the Power of Makeup highlight called Champagne Truffle. Okay, so I just did some inner corner highlight and put some glitter on it, and now I'm going to be doing lashes. I'm just going to be taking the Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara and the Eyler and Jasmine Brown lashes in Curly Clean, and I'm going to do that off camera, and I'll be right back. Okay, so now that my lashes are on, I'm going to be doing my lipstick, and I'm going to be taking this MAC lipstick in Faux, and then I'm also going to be taking the Fenty lip gloss. Okay, so this is the final look, and if you like this look and you like this video, please make sure to give this video a thumbs up, make sure to subscribe, and thank you so much for watching, I will see you in my next video.